If your vehicle is equipped with manual front seat adjustments, reach down and find this lever under the front seat. Pull up on it while you slide the seat forward or backward to a desired position. Release the lever to lock the seat in that position. To recline the front passenger seat backs manually, locate this lever on the outside of the seat. Pull upward and lean back. To bring the seat back upright again, pull the lever and lean forward. When returning the seat back to the upright position, always be certain it is completely secured in the latch position. Pull up or push down on this adjusting lever repeatedly to adjust the driver's seat height. If your vehicle is equipped with power driver's seat adjustments, look for this switch on the side of your seat. Push the switch forward or backward and the seat will move in that direction. Push down or pull up on the middle of the switch to adjust the height. To recline the seat, push this switch backward until you achieve the desired position. To bring the seat back upright, push the switch forward. The power lumbar support feature provides lower back support to the driver. Move the front or back end of the switch to adjust the seat back lumbar support. Folding the rear seats provides increased load capacity, especially important when carrying longer items. Both of the rear seat backs can be folded forward to create this extra storage space when needed. First, secure the outboard seat belts onto the belt hooks on the side walls. Now pull up on this release knob on the corner of the seat cushion and fold the seat back forward. Pull the release knob on the opposite side of the rear seat back to fold the second half of the seat back forward. When you return the rear seats to the upright position, be sure to reset the seat belts and ensure the seats are locked into position. Please see your owner's manual for important safety information, system limitations, and additional operating and feature information.